So if your gun is uh, doing that and the nail's not going all the way down, uh, what you're going to do is make sure you do a good service and then change the spring, which I'm going to show you today. Uh, first of all, make sure you get out the magazine, remove the battery from the gun, and then lock the gun out. And then the gun normally comes up with a hex oven key. You want to get that out. And then there's two bolt on the side of the gun, which you need to remove. One of them is out. And all you have to do is pull the clip, caps off, and then that should come out. Force. Force. All right, what you want to do now is to remove this spring, and then you got the collar, washer, to remove it out and replace it with a new one. So what I'm going to do is show you how to remove. All you have to do is bring it down, put a collar in, and then yank it out just like that okay and now we're going to do the same thing for the other side and then just yank it out just like that So now it's free. All you have to do is give it a clean and then we will replace it with a new spring. Right. So what you want to do now, I'm using a WD-40. I'm just going to clean the, this, the rods. Pull it out and just give it a good clean. back in Just like that and now so you can purchase one of these pack it's for $69 Bunning has it as well but you have to do a special order um, total tools normally have it on store for 69 bucks just make sure the model is correct here this is my model all right it's a 692 and this one here is also a 692 pack as well. Alright. So it comes with new washers, colors, and then also some new spring as well. Alright. Get all one back in. Now we're ready to replace. It's very simple, just let it in. Same thing for this one. This is the packet. So remember the order we came in before. So we make sure this is all the way in. Put the washer down. Put a little color in. A little bit tight, just your force, and then lock it back up. And that's it.
that's how you replace the spring. All right, so I'm going to do the same thing for the other side. That's how we replace the spring. Now we're ready to put it back in the gun. All right, so now after we put the uh, spring back in, we're gonna put the, uh, the collar back into the gun. Just make sure you align the hole properly. And that's it, it clicks in. All right, once that clips in, we can actually use the new bolt now. That's the, it's coming in the pack. All right. That's good. Now for the other side. All right, that's how you replace the spring.